Welcome back to my channel. My name is Gerard and it's good to be back. Today I brought along two of my favorite guns, the FX Wildcat Mark III BT Edition, custom built from the boys from Utah Air Guns, plus my FX Impact M3 PRS, which I've built up myself for competition shooting. I also have a brand new scope, which I'm going to showcase, the new Element Titan 3 to 18 by 50 and both of these guns is shooting some heavy 34 grain H&N slugs at a thousand feet per second. I see a lot of feathers and meat out there, so let's get started. Lovely. So I just cleaned my lenses on my GoPro and my Titan scope here with my Otis lens cleaning kit um, and I think before we start shooting this gun I need to tell you a little bit more about the new Titan scope. The objective on the scope is now a 50 millimeter, the tube diameter stays a 34 millimeter. On the elevation you can dial now 150 MOA which is crazy if you think about it which makes this scope perfect for long range shooting for air guns and center fires here you will see that the illuminated reticle dial is now smaller than the parallax dial and that means you can turn it now on without moving your parallax it's a 3 to 18 magnification the reticle is a dirty reticle that i've got here the hash marks on this reticle is nice if you want to shoot prs nrl as well all in all i think it's a solid scope and i can't wait to try it <laughs> down.
So I'm joined today by my two friends Kevin and Barent and the idea that we have for today is we need to do a little bit of practicing because we've got an upcoming match coming on. That's why I brought along my PRS gun here in the back. We've built ourselves a little course. We've got some tires here that we use for barricades. Got my gun in the bag, got some spotting binos here. And then at the bottom, we've got a prone position. We've got steel out at 100, 150, and then all the way out to 200. And if we don't want to do any practicing, we can just spin around and take aim at some pace birds on the wires. Now over the last couple of months shooting these H&N heavy slugs with a T-slot design, I've really seen some hard hits. But this next clip really showed me how well they expand. Wham! Just look at that impact. That is a lot of energy being dumped right there. little gong out there 200 yards I'm gonna shoot 10 shots for you quickly and let's see how good this gun holds the accuracy uh, 34 grain H&N slugs thousand feet per second that's a miss Hit. 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 I think that's three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, and just for a bonus shot. There you go. Two hundred yards, thirty four grain H and N slugs.
No wings. Straight to the ground. Look that starting. <laughs> Apologies for this next clip not being in focus, but when you're on fire and you're in the groove, you don't really care about focus. You just want to get your aim on and get those suckers down. This time it's Kevin's turn. We meant to turn on the scope cam there so that they can see what you are seeing. All right, it's on. One mil was for the wind, that's what I held. And then send it when ready. Yep, that's one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Oh, that's a mess. Nine. Ten. Just one for a bonus because you missed one there. Yeah, all wall is in the same area as where Harrod shot them. I just caught a few on the edge. Yeah. Probably less wind. A little bit less wind when you shot. But group still the same, same place as well. Same place, bottom off. Smoked him. Done, done, done.
Oh. Missed that last one. Damn. Just before I wrap up this video today guys, I just want to give all of you guys out there a big big shout out. My channel just surpassed 80,000 subscribers and I could not have done it without you. So here's a big big thank you to all of you for supporting this channel and making this happen. My next goal in mind is 100,000 subscribers and I know with you guys next to my side we can make this happen. Thank you so much again and I will see you next time. Cheers.